Hydra should not have made it in the top 32, let alone the top 16. At least that's what Mr. Psycho says. Hydra should not be in the round of 16. In fact, they shouldn't even be in the bracket at all. I guess I busted his bracket too. <laughs> this week we're going up against the Black Dragon. And I've seen a lot of posts saying, well, there must be some surprises in stock for us. Well, no, we're not going to see the Hydra vert. But you will see the standard Hydra config with forks back to it. One little thing. I wanted to show you a little sneak peek at how we actually sharpen and make sure that we win all the ground game. You need your wedges super tight. What you gotta do is you gotta hone it on a nice steel plate. You got a nice steel plate. We're just gonna hone those nice wedges in. Make sure they're touching the ground completely as sharp as you can get them. You don't wanna lose that ground game. Mm -hmm. Who else touches their wedgeless with a knife? Got to have that razor edge to beat all those boys in the ground game. And yes, we really do use a knife and we go back and sand it and sand it and sand it even more until that knife cannot make it underneath anymore. Now you wonder why I always get stuck on every little tiny seam in that box. The fun thing about this match was that it was actually slightly raining that day during Black Dragon, so we had to cover it up I mean, it's a hydraulic bottom and all, but you usually don't want your electronics getting all wet. Then after sticking a few batteries in her, nine to be specific, and then going through our torch test right before the match. You might wonder, well, why is Jake grabbing in that back hole? We've seen a lot of comments on this before. Well, as you can see from the backside, I have my dump valve and my actually air fill valve in there, so it's quick access back in there. And right back there is all the, the really precious, super easy to damage solenoid valves. So you wouldn't want to get hit in the back, otherwise everything is going to go kaput and it's done really quickly. Also, don't forget to stop by Scorpios' YouTube page because this week he had me. Those guys came on down here, filmed in the shop, and finally put it on YouTube. Well, part of their giveaway is a piece of Hydra that Black Dragon damaged in this upcoming fight. So I get to pick one of the comments and that person's going to win. So get on my good side? <laughs> it ain't gonna matter, you know that. And if we actually do make it through to the top eight, our next opponents would be either Blip for your flip vest that everybody is apparently wanting or Jackpot, the bot on a budget. Who do you think we'd have a better chance against? I think that's looking a little bit too in the future. Let's worry about the bot that doesn't die, Black Dragon. And if you think the controversy from Hydra has been a little overwhelming this season, I'll just leave this here. That's about it. Thank you. <laughs> I'll, I'll hold that against you for quite a while. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I forgot to say, I hope I win the nut, because I want to piss off every Hydra hater there is. You know who you are. Ha 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 